In the last project, I have generated more than 3,000 links. And sometimes you wonder whether some of the links have already been deleted. Now we can use XRammer to check whether they are still valid. Now I select the text file and automatically it will create a underscore mod file and a temporary file with dash mode dot dash keywords. And here you shall enter 200 OK. I'm not sure whether it is OK both capitalize or OK. I think it is OK. This version. Search the, the content. Here are the threads. It means how many threads you check out of the file here. I have 3000. So maybe I've just put 50. I click start. Now it is processing. Here it says 93, 94% out of checked. It is 200 OK. Using this method, you can also enter a particular keyword of your article that you, you are certain it has uh, been included in the article. You can put it here, or you can check your website URL, whether they still exist on the page. I think this tool is really cool. Uh, I have tried to use Scriptbox, but I found that this is the most uh, easy to use. I think the developer of Xormer is really cool. They have a lot of functions but uh, the documentation is quite limited i have spent uh, quite some time to learn from some people who use xrm very well so now it has finished working it has removed uh, roughly about uh, 200 links this means that uh, i don't need to waste the resources on the links that are no longer uh, 200 OK. 200 OK means the page is still open. Well, there might be a few mistakes when at that particular time the server has a problem connecting to the web page and it is wrongly considered that page as invalid. But I think the chance are slim because we are doing a massive uh, link building process. So we just don't care. The first, uh, uh, the first document is the original document where I have my my links in, and you can see that there is a larger a larger text file because it has more um, data inside, and this one underscore mod contains all the URLs that are 200 okay.